Hey, chillin', what's up with you? What up, though? Um, Connor? Like, Connor Barwin, who used to play for the Eagles. Uh, I'm trying to get Alshon Jeffrey and... What's his name? And Michael Bennett. Uh, do they have it in the solos? Is that a paying for it it should be because it's an extension because I got Alshon Jeffrey and Michael Ben already I just got to upgrade them get power-ups bro I'm watching you instead of doing my homework <laughs> oh man don't be doing that they're gonna, they gonna be like you could never watch 46 gang again you and that darn 46 gang I swear Connor if I catch you watching him again you're grounded. Deuce McAllister. Okay, they do have Alshon Jeffrey and Michael Bennett. Alright, so I gotta do those two solos. I they had have some nerve of as putting him as a cowgirl. If anything, he should be a patriot. He's not known for being a cowboy. But you know, it's whatever. Is there my mom's be uh, <laughs> I bet how much homework you gotta do. Win the game. Oh, two minute quarters. Alright. That's what's up. So it's gonna be cool because he's gonna be already an Eagle on the Eagles team team. So that's dope. A lot of homework. Were you um, doing homework at home? At home, like, are you homeschooled right now, or your state's open for school? Like, your state stay open back up. I got this. Hello there, it's project. the coach with you here I'm today, to and this is an ultimate Not challenge. Even that much. Now uh, let's I hand it off to Brandon and Charles as we right jump here. straight uh, into Michael the action. Bennett. Yeah, man. I, I'm I'm kind of debating if I want to start him because uh, he's gonna be higher than um, yeah my state's open. So oh, okay, so you're back in, in our school. First half, what yeah, he's gonna be higher as we are now back than um, what you call Fairly it, short kick, taking it to White, 14 here. Um, the, the Reggie White I have. So, but the. Um, well, that return gives him a golden opportunity to, White, to go out and fall. How does the defense respond so after giving up that do, type of return? Play the solos so here are the Eagles the, now as they get set like the for their first possession of and the second the free half. Reggie White like there that. are Free zero points on the White. scoreboard for either side. It'll be interesting to, get, uh, to see what adjustments were made. Well, the defenses have obviously been great. Yeah. So if you like defense, this is a classic game. This is what you're looking for. But now you're trying to figure out how to gain any type of an advantage on offense. Is it oh, through a big here, chunk play that they haven't oh, seen before? Uh, or is it just running your regular have his... offense and Why running it better, be trying Why to create an opportunity? Win? We'll see which avenue offense? they choose to go down. All right. All right, man, and the offense up. readies for a first down and 10. <laughs> they just do get the playoff as he'll look to throw. Oh, ooh, yeah, the coverage kind of terrific there as that's knocked down and incomplete. We've seen these defenses make enough opportunistic plays to keep this one low scoring. Flying around, making plays on the ball, and we see yet another errant throw as a result. Trying out some, uh, After the incomplete pass, passes. here now is second and ten. Yards there and an eagle first down. 
And this is why trying to cover the angle route is so difficult. Anyone awesome. playing the linebacker position, when they see a running back out of the backfield widen because he heads towards the flat first, oftentimes you widen too much and overcommit. Oh, no, he cuts up inside. Oh. And that's what we saw there. A nice pickup for a first down. Now, meanwhile, a pass that should have been intercepted, but it winds up falling incomplete. From the 34, they'll come to the line on second and 10. To throw again, Cunningham. Oh, I messed that up. Buying time, and he can't find Excellent. anywhere to go with it, and he goes down. Antoine Woods. He's the culprit dropping him for a two-yard loss. You never want to give up a sack. From the O-line's perspective, they hate it for several reasons, especially because they felt like they let little brother down back there in the pocket. Oh, no doubt. They have a ton of pride, and they go into every job wanting to keep that guy clean. They want that uniform with no grass stains, no dirt, nothing on it. But it's really, really difficult. You're talking about some terrific athletes who are trying to put him on the ground. On third down, Westbrook. And the play goes nowhere, losing yardage back near the 40 at the 39. That'll back him up two yards and also bring up fourth. I like the strategy. Extra tight ends, extra beef. They want to run the football, but that means they probably want to run it inside. If you get strung out on the perimeter, you're in peril. Yeah, we saw the result. Negative yardage. Cunningham to oh, throw. no, it's going to get picked. And oh, my goodness, this is incomplete. Oh, no, the Eagles unable to convert there on fourth. Everybody. And the Cowboys' defense is going to get him the football back. Well, you feel the excitement build on those fourth down plays. Defense has to stay out there, but for the offense, when that thing doesn't work out, hey, such what, disappointment. What up, it can absolutely be a deflator, but how about the defensive guys? If they stop you on fourth down, they are absolutely elevated going to their bench. They're elevated now. Big stop on fourth down. And welcome back. We are in the city of brotherly love, Philadelphia. I'm As trying to get that out on to Jeffrey rock and roll Barrett. for the fourth and final quarter. A good run got seven on first. Here's second and three. Here's Prescott. Got his uh, man there complete to Gallup. And he goes out of bounds. It looks like right at the 50. Four yards oh, to pick up. First down. Probably picked that off. He needs some pressure here. Draco. <laughs> Prescott now from the 50. Let's go. And he can't get a throw away. He's hey, taken do down. Don't do it to me, Prescott Draco. urging his guys to go quickly. They need to get up and set. Let's go. To try again after the sack. Oh, Prescott, give the sack to Fletcher Cox. Oh, Defense went 3-4. They go. got some push from the inside. And right this now. is something in a 3-4 you don't Maybe normally don't. get no because two. the nose tackle who got the sack He's usually he's responsible or ends up getting double teamed and sometimes triple teamed. How about him working his way back and putting year. the big guy on the ground? Yeah, this ultimate team. I'm playing uh I'm playing a solo right now, sorry. Yeah, They'll uh, need a big play uh, here, will Dak and the Cowboys right. after the sack. It's third and long. And this has been a familiar sight all BG. afternoon as they stop he him behind the line. Time, a rough go there on third down, a loss yeah, of four. Yeah, 96 overall. He continues to struggle to find a crease to break off a big one. It might need to just put that aside and just try and ram his way There's forward some random and get what he can. Here. Um, and back up just for boost. To boost up um, lockdown. And now and comes the Cowboys punter as he'll and, kick uh, it away for the second time. To him. Dirt max up to 30. But um, this is 50-50. Here's so Jackson to return. That's Go all I'm going to do. Oh, let's go, Jackson. Okay, DJ. Give him 11 yards that time on the return. And the Eagles will have it taken. Here's the Philadelphia offensive unit now as they head out to take over possession. They have a little bit of time here to get into field goal range. Not much. In a tie game, you don't want to do anything crazy, right? I agree with you on that one. Risk reward, okay? If you go for it, what is the absolute reward on this? But the risk is probably greater. Run the clock out, get to overtime, and try and win it there. All right, we'll see if they do just that. Pretty good results here on oh, the first snap. down run as he takes his oh, forward for about six. Now a final chance to stop it here as a timeout comes in with ten seconds left in the game. 
So with the missed PAT in his rearview mirror, he goes back out to kick this one off. This one fielded at the five. All right, you did it. You got the win. Congratulations. Keep that momentum going and tackle that next challenge. Okay, that was for Michael Bennett. Nice. Alright, so we got Michael Bennett. Alright, let's get out on Jeffrey. I thought we did get... I'm confused. I thought that was... Uh... I didn't get to see him on there. No wonder I didn't see him on there. I gotta see that solo again. Then I saw Reggie White. Got the Draco. Draco got the Draco. Hey folks, it's the coach here. Welcome back for another exciting matchup in Madden Ultimate Team. Let's send it down to Brandon God and Charles Davis for the call. After a rare scoreless first half, these teams now just looking for something as the second half gets underway. Oh, almost. And he's going to wind up bringing this one inside the 45-yard line. Well, that return gives him a golden opportunity to go out and fight. How will the defense respond after giving up that type of a return? 
So here are the Eagles now as they get set for their first possession of the second half. They have a chance to break our tie here as we get a look at the first drive of quarter three. And it's such a tone setter, isn't it? Because both sides trying to seize momentum to begin the half. What do they have dialed up that'll give them an advantage to move the ball downfield? Let's find out what they have dialed up. Meanwhile, they take a shot to start the drive, but this is going to wind up incomplete. On second down now, Westbrook able to push forward for about nice four down to the 37. Tough first half for him, unable to put up the numbers he's used to producing. But with a guy like him, you and I both know it just takes a couple of explosive touches for him to make an impact on this game and on the stat sheet as well. First down marker at the 31. It's third down. They'll keep it on the ground. Westbrook. as they work it inside the 10 to the 7. That's a gain of 31 with right around one minute to go in the quarter. Now a chance to make that big play really hurt. It's first and goal just outside the 5. Once I know it really works. They'll try the left side. Westbrook. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Taking it in for seven yards away. As his guys are first out of the scoreboard here this afternoon. Well, these two teams battled through a scoreless first half. Finally, a breakthrough here in quarter number three. And I just wonder how that played for both of them psychologically. Because when you battle through a scoreless first half, now you know that every possession is increasingly crucial. Who can put points hey, on the board? Make the other team chase? Subscribe, what if you, you get a lift and if they get deflated a little bit? Just a four-play drive that time. Tips. And in the end, it's capped off by a seven-yard run. Call it duty. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. This will be fielded at the 8. And he'll get it up past the 20 to the 22-yard line. What's your own favorite team? Here comes Eagle offense now as they get set to take over here. Turned it over, went for it on fourth, didn't get it. They're lucky, though, because no points against the team on the board, but we'll see how they respond. Yeah, they've got to get a lot of credit to their defensive teammates, don't they? They had their backs on that last series, and because they did so, that allows the coach to still stay aggressive on offense and maybe go for it again in a similar situation. I was say, maybe makes that offense feel good, but when you know you've got a defense making stands like that. Yeah, that'll loosen up things a little bit, won't it? Maybe you'll play a little bit better the next time you have the ball. Right, now, well, meanwhile, a final pass. play here is incomplete, and that's going to take us to the end of the third quarter of play. Oh, and welcome back. We are in the city of brotherly love, Philadelphia. It's the Eagles behind on the scoreboard, but with the football here as we start oh, the fourth quarter. And yeah, now the third down throw incomplete as well. He was unable to complete it there, and just not the game that you would expect from him. He's been off the mark, really start to finish. Yeah, it makes you wonder what exactly is going on. Is he a little bit dinged up here, or is he just off just by a bit? Maybe he can get it back in this situation. He'll need to. And he nice. can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. Fletcher Cox, the former Mississippi State Bulldog, ringing the cowbell there on the sack. So now let's look at the situation. They do have all three timeouts remaining. So barring a first down, they could conceivably get the ball back. So now it's all about defense and stopping the clock. Don't give up any yardage, right? Use your timeouts. And your offense always practices going downfield without timeouts. You know, those two-minute drills, uh, most of them are run in practice without the benefit of timeouts. They want to make it as tough a situation as possible. They're in it right now. Three yards on that last carry. Here's second and seven. That one looks like he'll throw here. For the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. Terrell Owens, the intended receiver. But now it'll be third down. They head to the line facing a third and seven following the incompletion on second down. Cunningham, flush to his right, to Ooh, the goal line, right. but it's incomplete. Try to fit that in. We just, um, 
Certainly looked like they were getting ready to convert there on third down, but what an effort to get his hand on that one, knock it away, and brings up a fourth down decision. And here's a big one now. Trying to hold this lead. They're going to go for it here on fourth down. On fourth down, Cunningham. And this is caught. And that could seal it. It's a touchdown. Well, it would be really easy to say that they are firmly in control right now, but I'm looking at your face and I'm thinking I've got to be careful with that. Well, it's a two-score game. You're inside of two minutes. I think you can breathe relatively easily now. Yeah, you can, but still, you got to stay vigilant. Can't give up anything cheap and easy. That could put you in some jeopardy. Still an important piece of business to take care of, the extra point. And it's good to make it 14-0. That one in the books as a 12-play drive. The result, Philadelphia in the end zone. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. So now Wentz and the Eagles down by two touchdowns. A minute 35 to go. They've yet to score all game long, but now they need to do so twice in short order to have a shot. Let's go, defense. On first and ten, here's Wentz. He finds Howard complete. He'll be dropped after a gain of about six across the 30 to the 31. Looking to throw again on second down. Wentz. Now the Eagles will use the second of their timeouts as they'll talk it over here before what will be an important third down. From the gun, it's Wentz. And this is intercepted, and that should do it. Picked off at the 35. And they will finally run him down, but not until he brings us all the way back down inside the 10-yard line. So many times we end a game, and as we're recapping it, we're talking about what offenses did and how they won the game. Let's flip this one over. The defense, they frustrated the offense the entire ball game. That's why they're walking out of here with a victory. And they're going to love to walk out of here with that as their final act, that interception. Good way for them to end it. So this one fairly well in the bag as they take over with a first and goal. And this play doesn't go anywhere. Backwards, losing yardage to the 11. The Eagles will take their third and final timeout as it comes with a minute four left to go in the game. On second down, Westbrook. And he'll be brought down this time at the five-yard line. A nice run there as he picks up six. It's going to be third and goal now. This has been a long drive. you got to figure a field goal would be a letdown. Can they convert now on third and goal? They'll keep it on the ground. Westbrook. And the hole closes quickly here. He can fight only to about the four. Only a yard on the pick up there, and it's going to bring up a fourth and goal. They converted once earlier on this opening drive, but now comes a big test. Fourth and goal. Hey, 
Here we go on fourth down. And he's in. Touchdown, Eagles. A great play there. His second touchdown of the afternoon. And the Eagles able to push further out in front. Is it okay if I break one of our rules, partner, which is to never call a game over until it's over? Because this certainly feels like it's over after that drive. Yeah, that was spirit crushing, wasn't it? And now you can, you just kind of felt the air go out of the balloon. Yeah, they were fighting so hard to stay in there. And they knew they had to stop them on that drive. But when they were unable to, I, I think you're exactly right. You could see them sag on their sideline. And I think this one might just be over. After the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. Wentz now on first down. And that is incomplete. Two seconds left on the clock. An incomplete pass leads to second and ten from the 25. One final try now for Wentz. And that will be incomplete as time has run out on this football game. There you have it, another challenge and another victory. Now remember, you can always replay challenges if you left any stars on the table. We should get uh, enough training, I think, from Andrew Thomas. Ooh, ooh, okay, I'll take that. Where do them coins came from? Go Alexandre dear free. Alexandre no way of all dear free. Alright, who else is there? Oh, uh, okay. Well, we don't need those guys. Oh, they got Ryan Kerrigan. I haven't seen that. That's what's up. Jesus Christ. Oh, okay, you could put the item in there. What with, with the power up? I guess that's how it works. Okay, so that's not too bad. Alright, so uh alright, let's put them in then. Let's 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 upgrade them. Probably gonna be a monster though. Yeah, power move is 98. Impact blocking. 
Fox has 95. We're gonna have to try him out. <coughs> Sell that to Thomas. How much I get? Oh, let's see if it's enough. Guess we'll upgrade Austin Jeffrey first. That's good. Oh, gosh. He's already better, though. He's His stats are pretty comparable. It's a little slower for now. But it should be just as fast or faster. Um, boost it up. Then we'll probably put him in D Jack spot. Probably, we'll see. If he's faster than D Jax, I'll put him there. Which I think he will be. training that sucks that's gonna be expensive I don't think I have any more training to quick sell somebody we got glitchy they put eagles and bears I know he was no eagle I'm gonna 
decent training. Take all of it. Give me all of it. Because all of this still won't be enough. Who's got the most training? Um, the free, the those free agents, don't they? Don't they got the most training? Freaking uh, like Jadeveon Clowney and stuff. Let me see. They're probably still expensive though. their training value is. Let me look on Mutthead. If anything, I could get, um, I get Michael Bennett powered up, then worry about Alshon Jeffrey later, because I want to try out Michael Bennett in the lineup. Get him fully powered up. And then he'll have the Eagles camp, so he's going to be a beast. is his training. Ooh. His, he gives you 48,300 training? 
Dang. Hold, let me check that out. Why is the value so different with these overalls? No, oh, no, it's the builders. Oh, yeah, they're cheap. Are they all like that? If so, I could get two of them and I'll be stacked. Yeah, because that's right. Carson Wentz had mad training. Oh, let me look for Carson Wentz. He was cheap. Yeah, let me get Carson Wentz. And then I could get cheaper training because he was like 70000 or something. Yeah, let me look for Carson Wentz. Yeah, he was way cheaper. That's how I got him for cheap in the first place. cheaper we look at theme builders too uh, if not I'll come back to Carson Wentz So that'll be good profit for training anyway. Where is his training? Come on, my Where's this? Where's his training? Okay, so they all forty-eight thousand three hundred. Alright, sold. Alright, so that's that's really cheap training. Pretty cheap. Um, that was gonna have some packs or something on weekend league. I guess not. I would sell some trophies so I get some more money, but I want to get uh, John Madden again, so I ain't gonna do that. See what we get from the store. Try to get some more coins from doing this objective. Come 
Oh yeah, give my coins. Gonna be enough to get him and Alshon, but you know it's whatever. Yo, yeah, wish he had a pass. Dang. All right, so now he could be in the lineup. Well, back in the lineup. He'll have to have abilities if he's going to take Reggie White's spot for now. Um, shoot. I don't know what to give him. I know I'm going to give him out the way. Out of my way. And under pressure. What's his main thing gonna be? Unstoppable force, fearmonger. Um, unstoppable force. I think that's what uh, what you call it has. Reggie White has. There too. Oh, strip specialist. Out of my way. Pass rush elite. Oh, that sounds cool. Edge threat. He is coming off the edge. on him with Rush Elite will be nice. Inside stuff. No outsiders. Go on stuff. Edge Rush. I mean, Edge Threat Elite. Fresh Elite will be good. That's between Pass Fresh Elite or um, oh Power Specialist. What's his power moves at now? Oh, 98. I think he should be all right then. It's pretty high.
could probably put Reggie White as D tackle. Oh gosh, that'd be crazy. Yes, that's what we did last year. Put Reggie White as D tackle and keep him as a backup. That way he could be um he could still have his Eagles Kim. Let's see that. I want to see how well this Michael Bennett is, how good he is. Should be a 99. Oof, my God. My God. Look at them stats. Jesus. I know the golden ticket Reggie White is better, but this guy's just gonna take his place till then. I mean, cause I can't compare him. But that finesse moves high though on Reggie White. All right, let's see some. Let's give um. We're experimenting, we're experimenting. Get the boost. Okay, we do have enough eagles. Nice. We stacked. All right, we gotta right, jump into a game now. Yeah, what does he have? Yeah, he has unstoppable force as well. Yeah, he should be good on the interior. Yo, this is crazy. We'll worry about Alshon Jeffrey later. We gotta, we gotta check this out. This might be the new Eagles theme team meta right here. Or I could put Michael Bennett on the inside, vice versa. I don't know. We'll see. We'll play around with it during the gameplay. <coughs> Imagine Reggie White. Golden ticket Reggie White. Oh, man. I can't wait. Yeah, Alshon Jeffrey. He just needs one more upgrade. But that's like 32,000. But solution is getting um, another theme builder power up. So. Let me see how it works if Michael Bennett's on the inside. If that changes the defense overall. While we're doing this, while we're experimenting. rush dang that's the only problem let me see if this could help out because we have enough eagles oh 
Oh, he won't get. He won't give the chems if he's out of position. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Did I get rid of, um, Bo Allen? I think I did. Why did I do that? Ah, uh, no. Nah. I need another right tackle. Okay, he's still there, but he's not going to give me enough. He's only going to give me one more. And I'd, I'll be short one to make it. Yeah, that's the only problem. So I need, uh, wait, don't I have an 80 overall? Would that give, no, I think to get two, we need to get like 85, right? Something like that? 85 or more? Or 89 or 88, 86? Let me see. You can only get one. Yeah, you still get one. Alright. Get my training back. Uh, okay, so. I think we're. Th I think they're like 86. I feel like 88, 88, 89 is the ones. Right tackle, right end. <coughs> oh, there we go. Cheap. Justin Houston, nice. We're going with Justin Houston. It really doesn't matter, but this one, Justin Houston. Alright, we gotta spend a little. We gotta spend money to make money, right? Alright. Because this scheme's gonna come through. We just gotta finalize it. Should give enough pass rush. And we have enough Eagles for the Eagles boost. <coughs> Times two. Yes, there we go. There we go, we're good. We are good. Okay. Alright, so... Yeah, we're definitely good, because now he's at a 90. That's gonna be, that's gonna create more push on the D-line, D-line is stacked. Uh, what experiment? Let me put someone else here so I can switch them around. See how I like it. Yeah, let me just put him here for now.
I'll try him at D tackle. What's Fuzzy, what's Fuzzy White looking like? Yeah. Well, let's try him. Let's try him. Uh, let's try him at what's gonna call it first. At left end. Play right. What's what's his block shit at? That's ninety six. What about him? Ninety six. Same thing. Power move is ninety eight. What's he at? Ninety-nine. Reggie White has a higher finesse move. Play rec was ninety seven with Reggie White's. Alright. We're gonna put Reggie White at D tackle there. This is what I did last year actually. Ended up being a 94 for Eagles Chem. So. Alright, let's activate. I feel like that's the best it's gonna get for now until I get that golden ticket of Reggie White. <laughs> See how that pass rush is. Hey, what up, Viper? What's good? Trying to play what? Um, what head to head? I don't know why I can't see my comments on here right now. Oh wow. We are in the stream. That's crazy. Dang. My cousin wants to challenge you all, Madden. <coughs> Alright, I gotta check out this um Michael Bennett. Um yeah. That sucks, man. I gotta end the stream. Alright. I don't know if y'all got the notification bell on. Just uh, come back. I'm going to come back, alright? Because uh, I hate when Madden does that. Now I got to end the stream and start all over. Otherwise, if I had like, if I had OBS, I could have continued the stream, but I'm doing it off the PlayStation. So, y'all just make sure y'all come back. Alright, I'll be back.